Sidisiri Mongkulsiri directed the Thai thriller drama film Hunger on Netflix. It chronicles Aoi's journey into the world of fine dining and cooking as a young woman from a humble upbringing. Aoi develops her culinary talents and strives to become extraordinary while she works with the obstinate and committed chef Paul. Here is everything you need to know about the conclusion of hunger if you're wondering whether Aoi succeeds or gives in to the demands of her new job. Spoilers ahead. In hunger, a young woman named Aoi is a cook at the Pad CU, Thai stir fried noodles, eatery owned by her family. Aoi's father is elderly and has two younger siblings. To help her family and pay for her younger sister's education, she operates the noodle store. Paul Taylor, a well-known chef, is in charge of Hunger, a group of talented cooks that serves Thailand's powerful and affluent citizens. Tone, a member of Chef Paul's staff, visits Aoi's noodle business one day and is impressed by her talent. Aoi is invited to Hungary for a tryout by him. After showcasing her frying prowess, Aoi is chosen to replace a team member who was recently let go. During her first assignment under Chef Paul, Aoi struggles to fry pork and receives an ultimatum from her boss. However, Aoi spends the night in the kitchen and perfects the dish, earning her place among the elite chefs. At a catering event, the wealthy guests applaud Aoi when she pan fries pork for them. A business magnate named Mr. Tooze gives Aoi his card and asks her to contact him if she needs help. Later, Chef Paul insults Aoi as she is only good at frying and does not possess other cooking skills. Aoi and Tone become closer in the interim. AP starts improving as a chef as a result of Tone's assistance in honing her techniques. One day, a member of Chef Paul's staff is let go after being caught stealing important kitchen items. A few days later, Chef Paul dismisses Dang, the team's most seasoned chef. But before departing, Dang stabs Chef Paul in the stomach, resulting in the latter's hospitalization. Aoi learns about Chef Paul's philosophy when she visits him at the hospital. According to Chef Paul, one needs to harness their hunger and be driven by success in order to become a competent chef. Chef Paul's team accompanies a wealthy client on one of his hunting trips. The client hunts down an exotic bird and wants Chef Paul to cook it for him. However, Aoi is against cooking the bird as it belongs to an endangered species and it is illegal to hunt it. However, Chef Paul berates Aoi for her moral righteousness and argues that one has to compromise on their morals to become successful. As a result, Aoi realizes that Chef Paul has become blind in his hunger for success. As a result, Aoi quits her job but does not give up on her quest to become a famous chef. Eventually, Aoi turns to Mr. Tooze for assistance. He makes an investment in her and helps Aoi launch Flame, her own upscale restaurant. Aoi must overcome a number of obstacles before she can demonstrate her ability as a chef and put Chef Paul's supremacy and popularity in jeopardy. Aoi too grows apart from Tone and her family. She and Tone part up because Tone is envious of Aoi's quick ascent to the top of the city's culinary scene. In spite of this, Aoi's pursuit of perfection causes her to worry continuously and develop paranoia. Aoi receives a visit from her former boss, who informs her that they will be competing at a wealthy socialite's birthday party, while Aoi gradually begins to resemble Chef Paul. Does Aoi defeat Chef Paul? Aoi finds out that she will be providing the food for an affluent socialite's birthday celebration during the film's climactic scene. Mr. Tooze thinks the occasion will enable them to advance flame. Aoi discovers, however, that she did not obtain the catering contract. She will instead compete at the celebration against Chef Paul, her old boss. Aoi displays her personality and skill while cooking at the celebration for the city's wealthiest residents. All of Aoi's efforts, however, are quickly surpassed by Chef Paul's expertise. As a result, Aoi understands that adhering to Chef Paul's advice won't help her win the competition. Instead, Aoi goes back to the fundamentals and prepares kribabi noodles, a recipe from her family. While the story behind the dish and its taste win the guests' hearts, Chef Paul again swings things in his favor. However, Chef Paul is arrested by the police after a video of him cooking illegal meat goes viral. Mr. Tooz reveals that Tone shared the video with him in exchange for funding for his own restaurant. Ultimately, Chef Paul is defeated and faces the consequences of his actions. 
meanwhile, Aoi is disappointed as she did not win the contest because of her skills. Instead, Mr. Tu's and Tone's machinations highlight their hunger and greed. The pair's behavior is ethically reprehensible, much like Chef Paul's. Hence, Aoi is unable to demonstrate that her abilities and commitment to them are more important than outside influences and manipulation. Because the former master and trainee have very different approaches to cooking, Aoi and Chef Paul are at odds ideologically. Chef Paul's desire for achievement defines him, whereas Aoi's morals and beliefs from her family define her. Despite Paul's setback, the conclusion suggests that Aoi can never succeed in the competitive culinary industry, since her principles will always keep her back. Why did Aoi quit Flame? After learning of Mr. Tu's and Tone's schemes, Aoi leaves Flame in the movie's closing seconds. Aoi is made aware by the duo's activities that they are possessed by their drive to succeed and will stop at nothing to make it happen. Their hunger transforms into greed as a result, violating all moral rules. In order to avoid succumbing to avarice like Chef Paul, Mr. Tu's, and Tone, Aoi leaves flame. Aoi sacrifices her family and other important aspects of her life in order to succeed professionally. She returns home after realizing how much her family means to her. Aoi ultimately gives up on her goal of becoming a renowned chef of gourmet dining. Instead, she gets in touch with them again and resolves to take over the noodle store they own. Aoi discovers that during her journey, she had always held the qualities needed to improve the quality of life for her family. She was caught off guard, though, by the glitz and glamour of the brand new world she entered. Aoi eventually goes back to her lowly beginnings as a jaded but more knowledgeable and experienced cook. She makes the decision to reopen the noodle store owned by her family in order to use her newfound expertise to expand the company. Moreover, Aoi is clearly motivated by her love for her family and cooking. Hence, it is safe to say that she will no longer be miserable and will spread joy through her food, as she always intended.